like how this works. Now we get the joy of inviting another friend. Welcome, Sarah, to the stage. So I got the joy of meeting a, a really neat guy in a really weird place on the eighth floor in the Royal Jubilee Hospital. If anybody knows where that is and what that is. Um, all I gotta say is the higher up you go, the more it's like a hotel. So. <laughs> and just so you know, Royal Jubilee, they've got a, they got a menu for food. They do. And when you're in there for a long time, food matters. It's like being in prison. Food matters. But I met this guy named Arthur, and um, it's a busy place. We know hospitals are really busy, and they're bouncing people around all the time. And uh, we get moved around. I got moved into a new room, and they moved me past this guy. It was a single room. He was like this beside the bathroom, and they put me technically in the window seat. And I was like, I feel bad. I mean, like, if somebody left, wouldn't they move him over? and just give him the window. Um, but he was kind of lucid, and he was out of it, but he wasn't all the time, and it was really cool. And at the time, I was just kind of being in a moment, and I was a very social person, and I was just spending time with myself and many, many hours, just me, and I was like, I'm just not going to talk to people. And uh, I gave him me and I was like no I'm gonna talk to this guy and he was his head was facing the other way and one day he was just like black eyes is growing on a mountainside and he was like those lyrics are for you you can write a song so I wrote a song but that song is for him and it's called feel the dreams <laughs> Going continuously on the mountainside You said, that song's for me But I'm gonna write it for him You said, long live and prosper All I thought in my head was because Arthur inspired me 
Made me wanna give again Eight seventeen south I found a friend Thank you, Arthur. I don't know where you are, but you're awesome.